Today we're going to talk about solid shapes. It says I can compare two and three dimensional shapes. Remember we've talked about 2D shapes and 3D shapes and today we're going to talk about the differences between the two. So what do you know about 2D shapes? Can you tell me some things that we've talked about 2D shapes? There's one thing that's really important about them. That's that they are flat. And in our picture, we have a rectangle, a circle, a square, triangle. This says quadrilateral, but that's another name for a rhombus and a pentagon. We can count how many corners they have, how many straight lines they have. And remember those corners or those points are called vertices. What do you know about 3D shapes? What's the difference? Remember, 3D shapes stand up, so they're the ones that you could hold in your hand and you could put your hands around. So in our picture, we have a rectangular prism, a sphere, a cube, a cone, a pyramid, triangular prism, and a cylinder. You can also count the straight lines on those and the points or the vertices. So let's look at the difference between 2D shapes and 3D shapes. You can see in the picture of the 2D shapes that they are flat. And the 3D shapes are the ones that stand up. But what I can see is that, like in my cube, it is made of 2D shapes. So it is made of flat squares. So you put flat squares together to make the cube. This is a circle. This is a sphere. So let's look at the difference. The circle is flat and the illustrator is showing us that and they're showing us that the sphere stands up by putting that dotted line around the middle. So the difference between a circle and a sphere is that a circle is flat. Flat on the table, if you had it sitting there, it would just be flat. And a sphere is like a ball or something that you could hold in your hand that's round. This is a square. How many corners does a square have? One, two, three, four. This is a cube. So you can see the difference. The cube is standing up. It's three dimensional. It is made up of the flat squares. You could also count the sides and you could count the faces. That would be how many squares do you see in there? Oops, this is a triangle and this is a triangular prism and you see how the triangle is flat. The triangular prism has a flat triangle on the front but then it stands up tall. All right, let's play guess the shape. So I'm gonna tell you some clues about a shape and I want you to try to guess what it is. So this shape is, shape and it has a circle, and then it has one point on the end. And you might put a big giant scoop of ice cream in it. Do you know what 3D shape it is? It is a cone. See how the cone has a flat bottom that is a circle? And then it has one point. All right, how about this one? It is a flat shape, which means it's two dimensional, and it has six sides and six points or six vertices and it's the one that is a little bit more tricky it starts with a huh can you guess what it is it's a hexagon see how you can count the points one two three four five six now let's look at this picture i can see a cone on the gorilla's head behind the gorilla i see a wall made of rectangles and squares those are flat the cone is not flat see how it stands up on his head the floor under the gorilla is made of rectangles. Let's look at this picture. Tell me what 2D and 3D shapes you see. Can you find a cube? The dice are cubes. Can you find a rectangle? I see lots of rectangles. See the spaces on the board are rectangles and the cards and the money because those are flat. And I see some rectangular prisms, which are those little red houses because those are 3D shapes and they stand up. 
How about this picture? Do you see any two-dimensional or three-dimensional shapes? I see a sphere right here in the middle, but then I also see a circle. Do you see the circle? Right at the top of that ornament is a circle. Look at this sand castle. I see lots of 2D and 3D shapes. What are some that you see? I bet you see lots of cones. And do you see the flat rectangular sign back there in the corner? And then I also see a cylinder. His bucket is a cylinder. And I can see some cubes and I can see more cylinders with cones on top. There's lots of 3D shapes in this picture.